Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me, welcome back to Fallout 76. Okay guys, well you know, there's a guy over on Reddit that was asking today where you farm rubber at. And I use a lot of rubber in my in my crafting for when I'm selling for caps. And so I thought, you know what, let's run through a couple of the places that I like to go to, to farm rubber in Fallout 76. Usually the first place that I go to guys is I'll go over to Camden Park. We're going to travel over there right quick and we're going to, and we're going to check it out. Camden Park is right here. It's on the western side of the map, guys. It's the amusement park where you go for your daily dross toss. And I usually go ahead over here and I check out. There's some basketballs over here that I get. And we're not going to bother with these zealots. We're just going to go ahead. I'm just going to jump right over here. We're going to bypass them straight out of the gate. But I usually come in here. And I usually get these basketballs that are right here. Oh, you know what? Go to sleep. Go to sleep. There's a lot of basketballs over here, which is really, really good. There's another basketball. There's another basketball right there. One here, one here, one here. They usually get scattered, so I'd look over here. So right there, guys, that was nine basketballs and the three rubber apiece. So it's going to give me 27 uh, rubber right there. Um, and that was a really, that's really easy, really quick. The second place I go to, guys, is Tyler County Fairgrounds. Once again, if you go on the other, just right next to the jar toss here, guys, there's got nothing but net right here, so there's more basketballs here. There's one, two, three, four, five, at least five. At least five basketballs here. Also, guys, if you're down there at Camden Park, you could go stop in the Ohio River Adventures because it's really close and go ahead and get yourself some life preservers. Life preservers are actually uh, got rubber in them too, so that's something to think about. I'm going to kill these guys right quick. Life preserver. Hey, what's up, ghouls? What's up, ghoul friend? So life preservers themselves are worth not only two rubber, but also two plastic, and you get a spring. So there's one, two, three, four. So I think I got all the life preservers here, and that was 10. So that gave me 20 rubber just in those just in that little bit of time another spot you can head over to guys is grafton and you go over to the high school all right guys once you've gone into grafton and you headed to the north side of it and you have killed all the super mutants that want to kill you and you get to the high school go ahead and go in here hang a right go through this hole and there's gonna be kickballs in here guys there's basketballs and kickballs so there's all kinds of stuff in here look there's a bunch of them this is probably the biggest concentration of basketballs that there are in the area or on the map that I know of, that I know of. Now open this up. There's more in, oh, there's kickballs in here. Basketballs outside, kickballs inside. If I can get this one. Uh, I don't want to give it to me, that's fine. Look at all these, man. Look at all these. It's a, it's a treasure trove, really is. And then, of course, if you come over to White Springs Resort, which is right here on the map, guys, you're going to want to go ahead and you can pick up golf clubs. Golf clubs are actually, I think they have, is it two apiece? So any any golf course is going to have some golf clubs. So any golf course, like White Springs guys, is going to have golf clubs and the handle has a rubber on it. So you're going to get a couple of rubber out of those. So grab as many of those as you want, or as many as you can. Also, you can go to the Somerville docks, which are right here at New Gad. Go if you go to those docks right there. So there's one life preserver here. Also, fire extinguishers have rubber on them, so take your fire extinguishers when you can find them. They have two rubber apiece. There's another a life preserver right here on this boat. There's another one right here. Another one right here on this boat. Another one. There's another one down here on the beach. Also, guys, if I were you, I would head down to Weld Station. If you can take on the mole miners, take on the mole miners. Their breather and their filter, that's what you're wanting. Because every one of their breathers and every one of their filters has one rubber apiece, guys. Plus, you get some steel and some copper out of the deal, too. So, all in all, just that little bit of running, me running around is going to net me 185 rubber just from those few places. Alrighty guys, by the way, this is not, these are not the only places you can find rubber. If you know of any other places you can find rubber, please tell me in the comment section below because I, so that everybody else can find out because we'd like to know so that we can spread that out and we're not farming all the same places at the same time. 
So anyway, guys, in closing, my general rule is anywhere that there's boats, you can find life preservers, or anywhere that there's water sports, you can find life preservers. Anywhere that there are going to be regular sports like basketball or kickball or at either of the amusement parks, you can find basketballs and kickballs. The mole miners, their masks and their breathers. And then any of the golf courses, you're going to be able to find golf clubs. Pretty much that's my big go-to places to find the rubber that I need to keep me in rubber production for all of my crafting needs. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do that right now. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you, and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.